What's up guys, in this video I'm talking about Game Boy Advance for iOS. Now this tweak is available through non jailbroken devices, so you do not need Cydia for this to work on. So in the video description I'm going to have a link for it to go to the download. So you're going to get this, you want to tap on install app. You're going to get this page right here, you're going to tap on next, and then install app via over the air. So we're going to tap on install, and it's going to give you that. So I'm just going to go ahead and cancel that, or I'll, I'll just let it download. So once it's done downloading, all you got to do is tap on Game Boy Advance for iOS. But uh, I'll let this finish. Alright, so let's go on it. You're going to get this little pop-up. You can simply tap continue. So you're going to get this, we're going to go ahead and tap on the double screen. Now this is not fully compatible with the iPad, but you can still manage to work it out. So from here you get your settings, and I believe the guy's Twitter right here, contributors, contributors, sorry. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on search, it's going to say it's going to open up Safari, so let's just go ahead. Alright, you want to tap on the first link. Alright, and then from here, you got your uh, categories. Top 25 download, top 25 rated, and stuff like that. So, uh, let's just do Mario Kart. Alright. So, I'm going to go ahead and install it. So, tap on download now. Alright, you're going to tap on Open In, and you're going to select Game Boy Advance for iOS. It's going to switch, and there you go. Alright, so now you can see the game starting up. It's all going smooth. Now, I will have to quit the application because it would be copyright infringement on my end, but I only found two issues with the uh, app so far. For some being that some ROMs may crash, your application so you may, may have to download it from another website or get a different ROM. Second is that you will have to use the double zoom feature for the iPad considering their display is not to support it. But that's pretty much all the issues I've found so far and I strongly recommend those who like you know ROMs like these to download because you don't need to have a jailbroken eye device. If you guys like this video please click the like button if you have more questions post a comment and if you want to see more videos like these please subscribe. Thanks.